This week's fire had some people worried about the impact it could have on the return of a popular Rockton festival. Old Settlers Days is slated to start Thursday tomorrow. Michelle Rave joins us live from Settlers Park in downtown Rockton. And Rachel, organizers have already started setting up. That's right, Eric and Mimi. The show must go on. At least that's what organizers of Old Settlers Days tell me. They've had crews out here the entire week, including today, putting in some of the finishing touches to make this weekend long event possible. Now, those who are attending this event can look forward to some live music, these car neat carnival rides right behind me, some food, and of course, a parade full of fun for the family. There's always a concern when you have a catastrophe like the chem tool fire was. That was horrible. And you're never sure where it's going to go. Um, we had just made it through the pandemic. We just jumped to phase five. So we were hoping our luck was staying with us, and we were so close. Organizers of Old Settlers Days say the aftermath of the chem tool fire is not holding them back from setting up for this weekend. We are doing really well. We're, get, we're in the middle of setup right now, and it's almost done. We're um, almost ahead of schedule on things. Vendors are coming in. According to the Winnebago County Health Department, the event has the green light to carry on. Uh, the event organizers have been working diligently with the Emergency Operations Center uh, to prepare for the event so that it can be held safely. So it's outside of the zone. And so we again, the masking recommendation has been lifted. But if you're an individual with underlying respiratory conditions, you should. Organizers say any debris will be cleaned up before the gates open and say OSD will be safe for people to attend. We're um, several miles away from the evacuation area. So we're, we're in a good place. And with the cleaner air and the smoke settling down and the fire settling down, I think that part of it is behind us and not going to affect us at all. So come on out, enjoy being with people, enjoy some great music, enjoy some wonderful food, ride the rides and have a great time. Yes, absolutely. Come out and support the community and support the Rockton Lions. Organizers say they will not be issuing refunds at this time, but a lot of the funds will be used towards the Rockton Lions Club, and they support local organizations that are in need. For now, reporting live in Rockton for your home team, I'm Michelle Rave. It's nice to have some good news, Michelle. Thanks for that.